Nathan. Thank you so much, Nathan. You know, in 1975, Bob Sproul's opened Bob's Restaurant in Woodburn, Indiana. Since then, a number of owners have carried on its legacy, particularly through the form of delicious pies. But now, nearly 50 years later, the restaurant is finally due for some big change. Bob's Restaurant, which has long stood in Woodburn, Indiana. Bob's became opened on um, June of 1975. Has served its last pie. Well, you know, just like everybody else, that when that COVID hit, you know, we were, it was tough. And that was just kind of one of the icing on the cake that made me make the decision to, that it was time for me to get out of the restaurant business. On August 7th of this year, Tierra Bremer became the last owner of Bob's Restaurant. She was one of several owners since Bob Sproul's opened it in the 70s. Bremer worked at the restaurant herself until the former owner offered to sell it to her. The owner actually came to me and asked me if I'd be interested in buying the restaurant, and I talked to my husband, and we got the ball rolling, and September 29th, 2005, we became the owners of Bob's Restaurant. And now with the name Bob's no longer on the sign out front, it's changed hands yet again. It just sort of happened to fall in my lap. I just received a couple of phone calls one morning that it became available. Um, next day we looked at it and signed the papers a couple of days later. That's Kim Campbell, owner of Willie's Cafe on North Anthony Boulevard, who has purchased the former location of Bob's to put in a second Willie's Cafe. We will be offering a larger dinner menu here. Um, since we will be serving dinner here at our location on Anthony, right now we're only open on Friday nights for dinner. And even with some new elements being unfamiliar, the classics. I knew they had world famous pies and pretty good tenderloins. Will still give regulars a sweet taste that they know well. We will be having the same pies that she had. That those will not change. Uh, we still have the same pie maker that she had. So the pies will definitely be here and be back. But we aren't sure when Willie's Cafe 2 will open. Ownership has told Wayne 15 it will be soon. If you want to learn more about the past of Bob's restaurants and its presence in Woodburn, Wayne 15's Clint McMahon dove into its history and has an article on it right now on Wayne.com. Hundreds of thousands.